Hi everyone, this is my guppy crossbreeding project. I'm using these breeders to accomplish what's known as a back cross. A back cross is when a crossbred organism is mated back to one of its original parent strains. These breeders have been mated for nearly a month. Today I'll be moving them to another tub in anticipation of getting some fry. This breeding event consists of these blue males, which are an F1 generation cross between the neon blue and sunset micro guppy strains, being back crossed or mated to the purebred sunset micro guppy females. All of these females were virgin to start with, so the integrity of this back cross was ensured. From these pairings, I'm expecting half of the fry to have gray bodies and the other half gold bodies. These F1 generation males exhibit the backside iridescence even though they inherited it only from one parent, their neon blue father. Assuming that this iridescence gets handed down to half of the fry in the next generation, I'm interested to see how it's going to appear on the golden bodied fry. I'm moving the breeders into this 50 gallon tub. This way, after they give birth, I can remove the parents, leaving the fry in here for the first month. I didn't have to move the males because their job is already done. But including them is low risk because if they eat any fry at all, it'll be minimal. The very next morning I spotted fry. So overnight, some of the females gave birth. This generation is now one quarter neon blue and three quarters sunset microwave guppies. At this point, I'm not going to count the fry, but I am pleased that just by inspection, I can see that approximately half of them have gray bodies and the other half gold bodies. I'm now going to separate the breeders. Here's one last look at the F1 generation crossbred males that father the fry, and here's the purebred sunset microwave females. Most of them appear much slimmer from having just given birth. I return the females to the tub so that the ones that have yet to give birth can drop their fry. The next several months will reveal how the various traits of the neon blue and sunset microwave guppies combine in these back cross fry. While most of my guppy raising has focused on maintaining pure strains, this crossbreeding project has been interesting. Thank you for watching.